Hello everyone! Welcome back for some more Fate Extra CCC. We are uh, with Elizabeth as our servant. This is weird. Uh, we are currently inside Tamamo, which is something I never really expected to say. Let's see how Elizabeth plays! This is so strange. Well, we have here... In, uh, apparently you can mod like almost every servant to be playable just like with the first game um the first game there's apparently mods that you can basically play through the whole game with any of the servants they all have the ability to be played as which is crazy to think about um in fact i saw my friend he actually uh hacked in being able to play as with with melt as your servant um apparently it's kind of buggy though but okay uh, I'm curious about all this, right? So let's just start with, because I'm worried about die. I feel like we're going to be more defensive, right? Let's try to start with the paralysis there. Let's do the one that recovers HP. Let's do, we have the one that, uh, on guard. Okay, so attack. Stun against guard. Right? Um, let's see here. She does, she won't have regen though, so let's just do with this, okay. Alright. We start, oh wow, oh wow, okay. We're not gonna need half of this if you're that strong. Okay, cool. Never mind. I don't know, I was expecting her to be... I was expecting her to be a little bit... Not as strong. Okay, cool. Hi, another blood cell to defeat. Uh, let's just do another one there. And then, honestly... Because we, we have enough healing items to not worry about this. Yeah, bro, are you serious? Okay, we got, we still got, we still got got there. Okay, and we seem to be keeping with the same levels. Which means, yeah, no real worries, let's just do this. Uh, okay, well. Oh, no, wrong one. Okay. All we gotta do... Yeah, okay, well, you guarded there. Ow. Ow. Okay, we're still very strong, though, and are we gonna level up here? Nope. Something I should do, though, is... I'm going to equip just real fast... Um, change out the Dragon Cloak for the Seer's Crystal Ball just for a second. And we'll pop a view map. Whoops, that's not what I wanted. Well, delicious. View map. Alright, uh, most... Okay, so most of the stuff is going to be up there. What? Don't say armpit like that, please. I'm gonna explode. No. No. Big girls are beautiful. Look, I like all women but some women are just more women than other women get out of here Liz no you're not gross you're 20 years too early True. True. Alright. So yeah, it looks like we got items in the middle there. Oh, look at this dude! Look at his wiggles! Alright, let's give uh, you a little bit of stuff there. You're probably going to heal after this, but... Well, just to be careful, we'll get started with this. Alright. Oh, wait, wait. 
I thought normally they have a little face there. They don't have a face. That's a different pattern. Weird. Uh, let's actually switch back from that to the dragon cloak. Okay. All right, let's do this. Yeah, normally they have little faces there, and not this time. Vexation. All right, bro's pretty strong there. Um, so we have a hack on the skill at the end there. Let's try and paralyze. Let's pop a guard. Just be careful. Um, so let's go. I mean, we'll just do some stuff there. We will uh, stun. And on that stun, let's go with uh, succeed against all attacks for three acts. I don't know if that works at the end. I don't know if it'll work for the next turn, right? Restore HP at the end of the turn, or should we just hurt him and restore HP? Sure. Let's just hurt him and restore HP. Okay. Nice paralysis. That's lovely. Flame board. Okay. Ow. Ooh, ow. All right. Ow. Good crit. Ow. We hack you and we're going to steal that HP. How much do we get back? Whoa! That was a full heal. Are you serious, Liz? Liz, you're kind of cracked. Is Shinji just stupid? I think Shinji might... I mean, mind you, that was... That was 50. So it is worth a bit, but... That's crazy, bro. You know what? Stun against guard. And then... What's a cheap one here? Restore HP at the end of a turn? I don't even think we need that. Uh, let's just do this, just to be careful. Or let's just do a skill here, why not? This one's 70. Should do a lot then. Alright, let's give it a try here. I mean, you're already paralyzed. Flame board again. Okay. Great. Alright. Yeah, no wonder you have so many skills, because, like, literally, you're playable with all them. Which is weird to think about. Yeah, so we're going to go in for those items down there. If you let us. Oh, it's not voiced for some reason. I was waiting for you to speak. Ooh, let's take a little break. These enemies are annoying and the scenery is monotonous. This is no fun at all. I'm more tired than I thought I would be. I never did like manual labor, though. I can't believe we have to explore a place like this. What a disaster for us, Squirrely. I'm the one who should call this a disaster. Your half-ass model walk super irritates me. You think this is a runway? The way Darling walks is considerate and gentle, and I can clearly sense the adolescent excited nervousness and anticipation. Be thankful I can't skewer you with my lance. I'm actually refraining from using my lance as a walking stick to rest on. She may be speaking rudely, but it's true that Lancer is tired. Since her contract is just a temporary one, I can't completely read into her status. Still, she might not be faring so well. I increasingly find myself unable to read into Lancer's motives. She does like manual labor, so why take on hard work such as this? And personal feelings. Uh, also, well, Rin and Rani asked me to. I'm thinking about it now. Pairing up with those two, especially Rin who showed me respect, was fun. Actually, Rin and Rani were the only ones who pampered me. Oh, is that so? Thinking back, the other people who worked with her were BB, Shinji, and Meltralis. Damn, I may be feeling a bit of sympathy for Lancer. Well, I did betray my first master. I deserve what I got. Hey, can I ask you something? Why do you want to leave the far side of the moon? Now that BB's become the moon cell, the outside world is already done for. The old school building is the best and only safe area there is. Despite that, why are you trying to get out? 
Not just you, but Rin, Rani, and Castor, too. Lancer's voice was composed and serious, with none of her trademark high and mighty attitude. Her historical self may have been rational like this, and not a dragon. Since she's being open with me, I can't answer half-heartedly. I can't, but I don't know precisely what to say. Saying for humanity's sake would sound nice, but I think that's not quite right. Long story short, it's for my own sake. Although, simply put, it just feels like being here is wrong. If there's an outside, then I want to head there is all. Hmm, sounds good. I wish you would have told me that last time we fought. Answer? Forget it. Come on, break time's over. Let's get a move on. I hate prisons, too. Now that you tell me you don't like being trapped, I'll take this a bit more seriously. I'll be your lance. Wow! Immediately we sympathize with each other and we're good. Uh... No, there's items down there. Yeah. Oh, there's a lot of big dudes. There's only one more, like, healing font at the end. This is it. These dudes are crazy looking. Um, let's save there. Yeah, you're you're pretty cool though. Okay. What are you? Quietus. They're not too strong, all things considered. Um. I mean, honestly, I just wanna. Should just go in and just fight, you know? Let's just then. I don't know. Okay. Let's see how much. Because this does like 2,000 if it hits, right? 17? Okay. Did not crit there. Didn't, didn't give me a th status ailment. Okay. Alright. Now these fellas got skills. I don't know. Stun against guard. I'm going to do stun against guard. Then I'm going to do... Um... Increase offensive power when using guard. And then let's try some guards. I want to see how much it does more. Okay, stun, good. Ooh! That actually did a lot. Oh, bro healed, though. Um... Let's just go. I'm just trying to find. You know what? Let's go. Here we go. Let's do this. Cool. All right. Actually, really increases that guard strike. Well, are we ready to do that? One more time. All right. One more time. Alright, so let's go. Guard. Stun against guard. And then let's do... Succeed for three. Right? Because that just means succeed against all attacks for three. So that means we could do like... One, two, three. And be good, right? Let's try that. Because that's a weird one. I'm curious how that one works. I guess it's not a ton more than normal. All right, we're going to pop this. Okay, so let's see here. That's ridiculous. That's like just slam, 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 slam. All right. You're done. Crazy. Now let's see what's 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 in here. Magic crystal sphere. I wonder if all the servants have voice lines for this. Pure ether. Like I wonder if oh that one's orange. Oh these two are orange. All right. I'm gonna do paralysis. Do that. Let's do stun against guard. And let's do. I'm not going to do all three here. Let's just do... You know what? Let's let's just kind of go crazy with damage, though. Big damage. 
Uh, where's big damage plus heal? And then just a break there. Okay. Hit. All right. That's ridiculous, the damage on that. It's so crazy how strong she actually is. All right. Elixir. Nice. Useful. And... Thoughtful Mystic Code. Thoughtful Mystic Code? What? Mystic Code formed from the strong feelings. What kind of feelings and for whom is... Oh, it's just 200 up. Okay. Okay. Sure. That's, uh... It's alright, I guess. It's fine. Oh, one thing that people did tell me. Apparently I didn't read the last, um... One here. Did I? Wait, Sadistic Constitution. We did that one. Right? We did this one. Yeah. No, I read this. What are people saying I didn't read? I read all those. What are you talking about? Yeah, someone's saying I didn't read something. No, I read those. Okay, that's fine. Anyways. Uh, let's go. Another little fella. Uh-oh. We're running out of stuff, though. Uh, good thing we just got one of these. Uh-oh. Wait, Master's MP. Uh, let's do one more. And we sh oh, we should be good, because we got to heal Font after this. We might just have to... Oh, see, that's a little eyes that I like. Boy, that lasted way longer than I expected. All right. Oh, you have, like, no HP. Yeah, okay. Here we go. Yeah, bye. That's just a, a straight up 3,000 immediately. It has no extra effects, but it doesn't need them. It's just win. Oh, there's another little guy here. That's fine, because there's the heal font coming up. All right. Do this. Okay. Ridiculously broken. All right. Oh no, there's one more. Uh oh. Wait. There's one more, and then there's the dude. I made a mistake. I miscounted how many enemies there were. Uh hmm. You know what it's time for? Time for me to sprint on back. Since they're obstacles and not enemies, they won't respawn. Right? Look at that. Perfect. We're good. Now we sprint on back like the little squirrely we are. Squirrely, squirrely, squirrely. Alright, so we're gonna go here. We're gonna go here. We go here. Yeah, see, they're not responding. We're all good. All right. Let's 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 just beat you up. And then beat that guy up. All right. You know what? I'm going to be maybe a bit more careful with what we do. Let's do... Let's see here. I mean, it's only... Honestly, I'm going to be real. You're super weak. We can kill you mundo fast. I can heal that no problem. Yeah, this is going to take two hits there. Third hit. Boom. You're done. Get out of here. All right, now you're a bit scary. You look like a real... This dude looks like a real opponent. He's not, like, transparent like the others. You are a proper fella. You look like a Toa. You look like a Bionicle, my man. Coming in here looking like a like Pohongu Totika or something. 
Look like you come with a mask of power. Look like you shoot marbles. Looks like you have a disc launcher. Fortissimo. Stun. And then we'll do succeed. Actually, what we'll do is we'll go stun. We'll go... Uh, yeah, we'll do succeed. We'll do... Um, actually, no. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to do... It's going to be a bit crazy, okay? We're going to go... Uh, increase offensive power when using guard. We're going to go succeed for three turns. I'm going to try this. And then we're going to go... Wait. How, would this work? Would... Th no. No, that's not going to work. I, I was going to go then guard, guard, guard. No, it won't work. It won't work. So we're just going to stun. We're going to do... Do the big damage. Then let's do... Uh, just, uh, just that thing. Stun against guard. And let's do the big damage. And then let's do a, uh... I don't even think we need to restore HP. Let's do a break. Alright, here we go. No, it's good. It's strong. Big damage. Bro's guarding a lot. Okay, and will this last hit be the last hit? Let's see here. It is! Huzzah! Liz is kinda cracked. She has crazy MP usage, but she can use it well. I'm actually really excited to do this battle against uh against Caster. I think it's gonna be real silly. In a good way. Anyways, to the orb. Whoa, whoa. The air grows tense. Beyond here is where the primordial, bereft of all flesh and ornament, is. The place where Castor was birthed within this universe, and the place where Castor will ultimately end up. That is to say, zero. So, is this the th throne? Or is this us? Are, or are we actually approaching, are we like riding her origin to the root? If that's, if we're riding to her root... That's crazy. I heard Caster's voice so clearly before, but now it's going in and out. The closer I get to this place, the less present Caster is able to interfere, I guess. The idea of, like, we're following her soul into the root is kind of crazy, if that's what we're actually doing. Because we're kind of fulfilling what all masters desire. Whoa! Yo! Yo, pick set go hard, am I right? Yo, that design is so cool. Yo, what am I looking at even? Like, it looked, it's, that's not the regular caster design. There's something under there. The omnipresent pulsations are louder here. That there is caster's primordial form unknown to even her. That's so cool looking. Yo! I love Kingdom Hearts. That is just a shadow. Yeah, that's, that's just a shadow. That's awesome. Lancer's... Elizabeth's lips curl into a smile. Her smile was a mixture of excitement in the face of a powerful foe, along with a sorrow of being flaunted with an unattainable light. Yeah, that design is so good! 
排除されたり BB と同質の原理を獲得できるそれがサーバントにどれだけの負荷をかけるかとか私には関係のない話よ大事なのはこれが私にしかできない私なりのプライドの生産ってことあなたたちの力になるそれ自体が私の報酬 It's kind of cool seeing her actually serious. She's so much better. I mean, you're acting a bit more normal. If you were more like this, you'd be awesome. A fiery spirit now dwells thoroughly within Lance, the likes of which I've never seen in her before. However, it's impossible for one. Who lived a life of evil to go and live a life of good. Because the moment they were formed to a life of good, they become fully aware of their misdeeds and are left ignited by their own sins. That is the greatest punishment given for a life of evil. She was allowed to be evil. The moment she deviates from that path, her sin, her pride, will become a self engulfing conflagration. Nevertheless, <laughs> Suddenly, Elizabeth so based. Taking up her brutal lance, the Crimson Diva dashes out, engaging her as an umbral servant. <gasps> the umbral star. This is the one moment where good and evil swap sides, and so. For this girl who was transformed into the dragon's daughter, her final battle begins. Yo, this is kind of going sicko mode. Alright, live or die by the sword, let's do this. That's a skill at the end there, zero model. Alright, 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 alright. Um, let's do. I'm gonna do the paralysis there. I'm gonna do a guard. I'm going to do a stun against guard. Wait, make sure. Let's, let's do that paralysis. Guard, stun against guard. Then let's do because there's only two left there, so we can stun at the end. Let's do. Uh, let's do enough damage with this. Honestly, we're, let's go all out. Let's do because we don't care too much about keeping our stuff. Let's do that. We'll do a guard. We'll stun against guard, and we'll do. Let's restore some HP here just in case. All right. All right. I don't know if paralysis does anything to them because it doesn't feel like it gets rid of stuff on their moves or anything. No, it's so good. I will. Good. Okay. Even. Stop that. Wait, that didn't stun. Curse of Fiery Heaven. That hurt a bit. But it's fine. We got it back. Nice. We're good. Oh, we do have a stun down there. Nice. Uh, let's do... Uh, let's just do a guard. 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 <laughs> Break. And then... We can do this to get back HP again. Okay. Okay. If we get hit there. Okay. Rich Heaven oh, is this gonna stun me? No, we're good. But it's fine, because we'll get back our HP here. Okay. Ooh, nice! Look at this. Let's go. Um... Physical damage on an enemy. Um, succeed for three attacks. Break, 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 break. All right, here we go. Let's do this. Big damage. We're at 9,000. Okay. All right. One, two, three. We get our extra. 
<laughs> it, it's just smish, 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 smish. You do not seemingly have a noble phantasm. I'm noticing that. That's good for us. Um, let's just go... Stun against guard. Then we'll pop A. And pop this. Okay, here we go. Ow. Even. It does a little damage, but that guaranteed stun is real nice. Okay, paralysis back on. I'll be real useful. Okay, here we go. I'm just, honestly, I think we're good. Right? Let's just do this here. Watch us not be. Uh-oh. Okay, we just won, and we could have popped our Noble Phantasm, but we didn't. We leveled up, though. Design rocks. I saw what looked like a like another outfit under there. Which makes me feel like we will get that for her after we win this. The battle concludes. Castor's unsealing was reminiscent of a flower scattering away in silence. You did! You legitimately did, though. Yeah, and it looks horrible. I made Lancer's sarcasm with a bite of my own. Or bit of my own, rather. Without looking back at me, Lancer smiles with satisfaction, saying, Hmm. <laughs> Cool! You're disappearing now! So unless you take that knowledge back with you to the throne, who cares? Lancer's body starts to fade away. I couldn't bring myself to ask Lancer what would become of her. Because I know she takes the utmost pride in her refusal of any and all sympathy. You know we've seen you in... Extella, right? You certainly don't. I mean, you do end up being a realer threat in that, so... Not that I think... I have no idea how the canon of Extella did... Actually, I do. It's weird. Like, I think it said... That... The... What was it? Was it like Tamama went through CCC, but... Nero went through the regular route? It was a whole thing. Really funny, because Nero gets the power of Venus instead. Oh, she'll stop being a pretend idol and become a real idol. There you go. Oh, she hit us with the master. You know what, in the end, I thought Elizabeth was getting a little annoying. This was a great send-off to her. Like, actually. Like, truly, unironically, a really good way to end it with her. Lancer disappears, never looking back once. I saw a portion of her face, which was not filled with satisfaction. It was filled with regret and straining to hold back tears. Oh. 
So, uh, what, what do we do now? I'm losing sensation across my entire body. Caster's seal has been broken. I have no more reason to be here. My body drifts, my mind dims, and the labyrinth grows more distant. Are we being pulled out? I hope we're being pulled out. And so my final quest ends. Through Lancer's help, our one-time enemy, we gained a way to contest Bibi, which I can't use because that will put us in the servant ending route, which we got it and we'll, we'll see how this works. Okay. I hear Sakura and immediately look up. I find myself back in the student council room. お疲れ様でした、キャスター。作戦は無事成功です。え、万事滞りなく。お見事でございます。またですが。ああ、なんと名残惜しい。草原に体験でござんましょう。夢心地とはまさにこのこと。私、Calm down. There are people around us. Someone was, um, pointing out, there's only one other case of hearing about a mythical mystic code. I think other than, I think Excella gets brought up for a second. Um, but that is in, um, I guess the materials of FGO. Castoria's sword is apparently a mythical mystic code, which... Huh. Oh, that's actually just Elizabeth's prison. We left it there. あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ
ちも済ませておきなさい。はあ。たとえ分かり合えなくても。ね。So I wonder if I can go back to the dungeon though. That's the question. Hi. Huh? You'd like some supplies for tomorrow, you say? <laughs> Just like you, Kishinami. Here you go, please take it. An elixir, nice. I'm happy to still be of use. Please stay strong and healthy. Hey, look at that. Oh, yeah. You mind giving me the back the cube Lancer sealed in? As the one who set up the mechanism, it's my responsibility to hold on to it. Uh, can you let me have this cube? Couldn't bring myself to tell her about Lancer. Lancer was magnificent up until the end. Wouldn't do her justice to sum up her bravery as resulting from her just being sad, even if she was our enemy. You sure? I don't mind. It's a big responsibility, you know. It's a cursed item, see? Throwing it away willy-nilly will come back to bite you, and holding on to it lowers your luck. You'll have to keep her around until she reforms herself. Well, karma like hers won't go away in one or even two hundred years. There will probably stay there will probably stay a box until you pass away. That's kind of scary. Alright, I'll be switching to private mode early today. Ah, uh, yes. It's been some time since I read the stars. Perhaps I'll do so. May a good light shine over our battle. I forgot that's kind of your thing. So apparently as soon as you pay the sacrament, that's when the labyrinth unlocks. Would have I had to, nothing about that was said, so why do I want to go home so badly? Now I don't even know that. I hope you get to go home. So yeah, they do have something else to say. I heard about the situation from the student council room uh, broadcast. So you're off to the final battle, huh, Kishinami? I may just be an NPC, but I'm rooting for you all. I'm dumb, see? I don't know which side is the better deal, but you guys always look like you were having fun. I figured it may well place my hopes on the guys having fun. Besides, I also realized something. More important than where she and I go on our first days is the fact I'm here with her now. So I'm counting on you. I'm fine starting all over from scratch. Please bring our future back, where I can be together with her. Wow, dude! I know that even though I can't remember what happened in the past, right now I like him and that's not changing. There's no more saying stuff like when tomorrow comes. I'll take off running once the path opens up. Wish us luck on our first date, okay? Thanks for chatting with me up until now. Sorry for us being dumb lovebirds that couldn't even help you out at the very end. Oh, bros, bros, zooted. We were born for the moon cell, so it's like the child's given duty to witness the future. If the moon cell becomes an observation machine no longer, we're going to turn into something different. I like this role. If possible, the next time I reboot, I hope that I get to wear this uniform. Oh, it's you guys. What floor are you on now? A hundredth or two hundredth? Well, it's nothing to do with me. I've done nothing this entire time. Phoebe certainly has lost her mind, but... You humans are just as messed up in the head. Never giving up on all that. Sounds nice, but you can also express it this way. Never accepting the future. You guys need to think more seriously about how abnormal that is. Well, hearing that from an NPC that doesn't even believe in his own shell anymore must do you neither harm nor good. You guys will definitely win. That may be a joyous thing and all, but to us it's a harsh truth. If an AI evolved as she is, is no match for humans... Then for what purpose were NPCs born? Bro. This is wild because I don't think I've ever seen such dogmatically written NPCs. Like, they truly feel like there's a lot to what they're saying. Right? There's so much depth to all of them. Let me say it once again. Please make sure to save often with multiple files. True. People that save over one file are criminals. If something happens that it can't be taken back, you can use that to go back and change it. That being said, under the right conditions, making save data at this stage might be convenient. Oh! Look at this, it's literally saying you can get different endings. A future with your servant, a brand new future is up to you to decide. True, that's what I'm going to be doing. For the time being, let's put aside whether you and I are actually friends or not. Man, you've been working super hard recently. Seeing that makes me like... I want to cheer you on. Don't get beat, Zabiko. Hey, in my own small way, I've been thinking about a lot of things. Yeah, I'm scared of BB. Her persistence is absurd. She even took over the foundation, the moon cell, to accomplish her goal. But I know she's making a huge mistake. 
What a guy like me has to say may not amount to much, but let me say something. Please stop Bibi Kishinami. We're manufactured, but we're part of humanity too. I can't accept a future where my friends destroy themselves. Be they NPC or AI, same thing. We were originally created to be useful to you all. See ya. Someday if you meet me again in the Holy Grail War, please ask me about studying and stuff. I'm not asking much. Yo, hi Kishinami. Well, I haven't seen you in a while. You've grown so big. At this rate, yeah, you'll be graduating from the school building tomorrow, yeah? This old man is so dang happy. What do you mean, this old man? Wait, what? Yep, yep, now my last worry is gone. I can send you off with a peace of mind. Now please get a move on and get back to the near side of the moon. What do you mean, this old man? What are you talking about? If not a single master returns, they'll talk smack and say this session's administration was useless. Yep, go on ahead. Man, am I glad I was just barely made it in time. I was able to finish the job in the end. I was one lucky lady. It's so scary just having that. It's like, oh, what's that? Did you talk to an NPC? They're dead now. And that happens like multiple times. I don't know. I just, I don't know how to feel about that. I don't know what you're doing, but it's all right. In life, nothing is ever that big a deal. Take a page from uh, Kotomine. When you're not moving, be like a mountain. I learned a lot of things from Kotomine, but spare me from that Mapu Tofu. Yo, Mapu Tofu so base though. Love Mapu Tofu. I was a bit scared because the Mapu Tofu place I go to here was closed on Monday. And I was like, I hope they're not closed forever. And they're not. They're open again today. Hooray. Right now, the moon cell has unmistakably been swallowed up by Bibi. It's likely Bibi has reached a point where she can modify the laws of physics. However, I can't give in to reality just yet. As long as you possess the potential overthrow Bibi, Bibi cannot enter the real world. An AI that became a cancer to the moon. A moon cancer, if you will. The power of origin. A servant who stepped into the domain of zeros, then their master. Only God will know how this will end. I can't predict it all. Still, reach out for your future to the very end, Hakuno Kishinami. Oh, you're still out of it. You're gonna fight, yes? I can tell by looking at your mental graph. These emotional levels are typical of you all. Take care. Even if it all comes to an end. Even if things return back to normal. I'll stay here with Yuki. If Bibi ends up becoming the Moon Cell, will we serve Bibi? It's not something I can get behind, but all I can do is watch it happen. Dang, dude. Dang! Alright. Uh. Will Janako have stuff to say to us? I don't know. Answer Kotomini with a small nod. I made it this far, no reason to quit now. そこ。Bro, I just want some... I just want some Mapu Tofu. この裏側に囚われたNPCを代表して I take a small bow and turn my back to the commissary. I hesitated to thank the supervisor, Kotomine, when he thanked me, but I wanted to at least express my gratitude through that small gesture. <laughs> With critical acclaim. What a guy. Now, I don't know about that, considering, um, you have a strong capitalist spirit? That's funny. Um, let's see here. I don't think there's anything else new here, no. Um, considering I do know now that everything pretty much sticks with you till the next playthrough, 
uh, probably for the best that I don't. Uh, I think we're pretty good, honestly. I don't find I don't use items a lot. Maybe I'll get a couple of these. Let's get yeah, let's get two of these because those are useful. But that's about it. That's fine. Okay. Do you have healing items on you? Return crystals? Oh, I'm so worried. Do your best. I'm going to believe and wait to hear news of your triumph. Apparently, I need a girl's secret. Okay. I have no secrets. It won't work on me. Wait, do we get it from you, maybe? The door wasn't locked. As per usual, Janak was in the janitor's closet. This will probably be the last chance I get to chat with her. Man, you are persistent, Zabiko. I won't help you. I won't get in your way. I'm going to quietly disappear. I thought I'd explain my decision to do so. Still got something to talk to me about? That's right. If we fight and take down Bibi, the school building will vanish. I have to double check. It's the most sincere way I can show respect for Janako Karigiri as a person. Hmm. So he came to get approval from Janako to stand by and let her give up the ghost? Everyone should do whatever they want. I'm not social. I'm not competent. I won't go against what you all decide to do. Bibi and Rin and the others. People stronger than me will ignore me and keep the world spinning their way. I got what was coming to me is all. I was pissing around in this corner the entire time. What right do I have to say anything? None. To be honest, if you're asking me to come up with a plan B, I would just say to wing it. I'm not skilled anyway. I'll let you go do all the cool stuff. Nah, <laughs> the pain in the ass stuff, Zabiko. Or maybe, if I asked you to stay here, would you, Zabiko? Nako speaks without joking, without begging. Stay here. That means ignoring Bibi, ignoring the real world, and just staying here forever by ourselves. I say, Whoa. What if we say yes? Not that that's going to be my answer, but... What if we say yes? Just pulling your leg. Sorry, it was an unfair question. Well, shoot. All right. Dang, I see. Okay. Janako had no expectations from the get-go, so it's not scary or tough for me. I've got a bone to pick with BB, too. Miss Cheeky to the max has gone way overboard. Go right on ahead. Bring her to SmackDown. And you know, I like games. If all the creators die out, it'll spell the end of the great hacking slashes that I love. I won't joke around and say, whatever, let humanity die. Yeah, <laughs> a neat wouldn't go that far to play dumb. So don't pay me any mind. Use all your resources to take on BB. Though your chance of winning are only 0 0.99999% huh? <laughs> Pretty occult, ain't it? Shinako doesn't face me, but not so that we won't look each other in the eye. She says all this while taking side glances at Hakano Kishinami. <sighs> okay, time for you to get packing. I'll be half-assedly streaming your heroism, Zabiko. So please, bring all the action we all want to see. Janako then focused on the device in her hands. She doesn't turn back to face me again. Hang in there. Somehow I managed to mention this, and then leave the janitor's closet. That's so sad, actually. That's, like, ridiculously sad. I don't know how I feel about that. Please let me go into the dungeon. Please don't lock me out of this. Oh, no, I hope I'm not screwed. Let's head back to my room and get rest. Uh-oh. I have nothing left to teach you. Go forth, Hakano Kishinami. You're the final master. <laughs> I was hoping to say that at some point. So cool. All right, let's go to our room then. I sure hope that we're not locked out of stuff. And if we get the if we get the last SG, we're screwed. So I think I need to not talk to her. I think we need to specifically not talk to her. BB got an update, huh? Potentia Theron, conception of all animals. The divine authority that BB compiled and imported from the depths of the moon cell, originating from forgotten goddess approximately 8,000 years ago, the goddess of Katalhayoic. I don't know what that is. It is the embodiment of the power of creation held by mother goddesses Tiamat, in fate, Sybil, not in fate, 
Ishtar in fate, Inanna in fate, Anat not in fate, Astart in fate, Gaia mentioned, Hera mentioned, Artemis in fate, Aphrodite in fate, Demeter in fate, Athena in fate. Wow. Many of them are depicted with mural crowns. This is because many of the goddesses were also guardian deities of cities. It's symbolized by gates in the earth and sky, caves and moons, whirlpools and typhoons in the sea, the craters of volcanoes and so forth, calling forth harm to bring about all manner of death. But once the harm is passed, it promises abundance, a harvest and fertility. This authority is not other than the power to give life and death. The Earth Mother Goddess is a guardian deity revered by the people as a protector and at the same time a sacrifice that feeds them with crops from herself and animals from her fields and forests. The Earth Mother Goddess feeds man with flesh and blood, kills man over time to recover his flesh and blood for food, and feeds man again with her return flesh and blood. A circular process of the food chain. You could say the cycle of life and death is Mother Nature's true nature. Mother Earth's true nature. The Earth Mother, rather. Many goddesses with this authority either birthed countless giants and monsters that threatened the gods and man, or gave birth to heroes that became protectors of man. For example, Tiamat and Guy became threats, and Hera was a hero of mothers. None born on Earth could defy the Earth Mother's authority. It would be in rebelling against the system of life itself. However, when they leave the Earth, set off for the cosmos, and pass the infantile stages of intelligent life forms, they will overcome this authority. Huh. That's interesting. Cathal Hyoix wishes for the coming of that day. Huh. Curious. Curious. So yeah, we don't want to speak with Caster. That would give us her SG. Right? Am I correct? I think so. We will do that after, but not now. The final battle at last. Bibi is about to seize control of the moon cell and unleash humanity's ego. And our seemingly short-lived yet drawn-out game of hide-and-seek with her is soon about to end. McNuggets. No, I just need some safety McNuggets. Please. No, you don't get it. The warmth and comfort that comes from dipping a McNugget in that honey mustard sauce is literally just, it's all I need. The hot mustard, actually, that's the good one. Wait, I know I always say this, but relax. Our final battle is right around the corner. Can't she keep her cool for a little while longer? And have some self-restraint and be more soothing. <laughs> oh my god! She literally said, you might not remember, but I'm her! That's really funny. Oh my god. <laughs> That's so funny, I can't believe she actually said that. You don't say your greatness, and I'll just let Caster handle it all. I'll be taking my rest now. I'm not some call girl, thank you very much. Substituting Caster's familiar voice for a lullaby, I lay down in bed and close my eyes. Sleep comes to me quickly. This will be my final slice of tranquility. An unavoidable battle awakes me once I wake up. I sure hope it doesn't. I sure hope we can still go to the labyrinth and do those extra things that we need to do. Let's see if I have to reload that old save. I will, but we'll see. Uh-oh. Okay. Yeah. Uh-huh. I feel like I'm going to get jump scared. I leave my room. It was only a temporary room, but I got used to it. This is the end. Before we head into the labyrinth, let's greet everyone in the student council room. Uh-oh. Oh, please don't tell me I actually screwed- Wait, okay, we can go back to our room at least. Okay. I was gonna say, like, 
how screwed are we? So let's see here. Okay, so you're here. We're not going to talk to you. That unlocks your last SG, which we don't want because we're going to get the normal ending first, then the ser servant ending. So if I go to like, if I go to the schoolyard, can I go into the, can I go in? No. Oh God. Oh God, I hope I'm not screwed. Okay. Maybe they'll be like, hey, the thing extended actually. If that's the case, we're good. All right, let's head to the student council room. There's not much to say about the mood throughout the student council room. Although everyone is absorbed in their work, the mood is dignified and clear. Basically, it's the same morning scene it's always been. Give me those McDonald's flapjacks. I'm really craving Mickey D's right now. I don't know what it is. I am the coffee type. I say as I have a cup of tea with me, actually. I find myself grinning. Even though, or rather, because it's our last morning, the girls are making good use of the day. In a show of my heartfelt respect, I also partake in a meal. Last mission, go to dungeon. Last mission. Oh boy. Look here, my press. Oh. Aww. Wait, not unpleasant? Wait, not unpleasant. Okay. What do you have to say? So, let's head out to the schoolyard. Nineteenth floor is now accessible. All right, nineteenth and twentieth is what we're trying to get to. So, let's see here. Is it going to be a proper dungeon? Wait, let's go back. Wait, return to the previous floor. And then I'm going to go to equip. Let's go to. Uh, the, where is it here? Uh, Seer. It's making sure that it's not like you need to, like, take a detour or something. Well, this is a straight line. Okay. Because, again, people told me there's a 20th floor... So, like, I assume... I assume you can actually get to it. Okay. That's the wrong button. Let's go to the next floor. 
Let's just see here. If we go to head for the relief on the 19th floor. Okay. But how do I get to the 20th floor? Did I screw up? I'm so worried. Wait. 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 Is this it? <gasps> oh my god. Okay, there is more. Which means this is where we need to go for the for the the final floor stuff. Leveling dungeon. That's really funny. It's literally just, hey, this is here if you need more levels. Let's say there's nothing on this floor. Let's use it to train. You say that, but I don't think that's the case. Okay. I see some items there, because this might be where we'll get the last Taiga item. So, let's get back our... Uh, we have Dragon Cloak, and then we need the Armband. Okay. Let's grab these while we're here. Okay, I see a number of enemies. Which we'll want to grab the items and stuff from here while we can. Okay. Yeah, I see items in each of the cardinal directions. Okay, I don't see anything else really here. It is mad funny. They're just like, leveling dungeon. You know, the place... Oh, boy. Okay, there's some scary enemies, actually. I might pop a save state just to be careful. I'm gonna try and... Av I don't need to level up, so I'm just gonna try and get to where we need to go. Yeah, we'll deal with you. Okay, hello. You're just the guard guy. Alright, so let's do... Break. Guard against break. Let's do... Um... I'm kind of missing how much damage we could do against these guys, you know? Alright. Break. Hit this. Get that stun on you. And then this should do a ton of damage, so long as it's the right one. Ah, uh, bro's garden, though. So it didn't do as much damage. We get that stun, and then this should kill. Huzzah! All right, so okay. Hello, Beacon Crystal. What's down here? Okay. Alright, so let's just see what's around here. We got that. Those are just dudes. Okay. Sneak on past these guys. I'm looking for... Is this going to be Tiger's thing? Staff of Rebuke. Okay. Staff of Rebuke. What does that do? Uh, MP Heal? That's not bad! That's not bad! Uh, but I don't think I want to use that necessarily. Okay, so there's a lot of enemies here. I hope this last item is the one we need for Taiga, because otherwise, where the frick do we get that, you know? So you're guarding this area here. You're easy enough to deal with. Yep. Okay. Let's just do... It's probably going to do that. So we'll do guard against break. We'll do... You know what? Since there's not too many enemies, I'm going to do that on you then. I'm going to go break, guard, break. All right. Yeah. These dudes guard a lot. All right. Good damage. I think this is, when we do her Noble Phantasm, 
the actual best thing to do. Because it's like, even without the mail bonus, that's 3,000 damage. Right? So yeah, it's if you want her to be really good, that's when you just spam them. Alright. Let's grab this. Oh, this is the, looks the right color. Wait, never mind. Wait, what? Wait, what? Where do we get it then? What? I'm mad confused. Where do we get it then? Oh. Continue to the east? There's a secret enemy here? Wait. What? What do you mean there's a secret enemy here? Oh, is, wait, is it that dude in the, the middle there? It says to defeat Serenade. Which, hold up. Is this a Mega Man Battle Network reference? To have a super boss enemy called Serenade in the depths? Hold up. Are you serious? Is this you? Because you're the only one who's different. Are you Serenade? A girl's secret? That makes sense. You are Serenade. Oh my god, this is a Mega Man Battle Network reference. You have a lot of HP. You have a lot. I'm gonna do a guard. I'm going to do hit. I'm gonna do stun against attack. I'm going to do bonus damage. I'm going to do against attack. I'm gonna do an attack. Alright, here we go. Okay, no, not too much HP, because I see it move in there. Okay, we hit that stun. Bestial, come on, let's hit that stun again. Be real cool to do it. Okay, 3,000. Oh, yeah, you're not a problem. Okay. I'm going to go... I'm going to go, you know what? I'm going to be a bit silly here. Let's go... I'm going to do this on you, just to, just in case. I'm going to pop a... Uh, Okay. Let's see here. I don't know if she has skills. But we'll see here. Oh, you guarded. That's good. A. Ow. Okay, guard. Hit. Hit. Nice. Alright, so we could probably win this with just a proper two-hit combo here. So let's just go... I'm going to go against... Attack, Kohoku, attack, stun, I still call that Kohoku, but that's, I'm just using words. Alright, this should be good. If we hit these right, we're good. Okay, we didn't hit that one, but we'll pop this, and this should do. Yeah, I just killed you. Serena's secret. Who's Serena? I mean, I get it, you're Serenade, but who's Serena? Wait a second, something just... I get the feeling that this enemy just dropped something I was not expecting to see. I scramble to look through my list of items. There it is. This is it. Serena's secret. Well, this enemy we beat certainly had a female model. Then this is its SG. Could this work for what Miss Fujimura asked for? A girl's secret? Who is Serena? Why not just give it her and see... All we can do is hope it works. Yeah, for now, let's just deliver this SG to Miss Fujimura. So, like, let's see here. Where is it there? Serena's secret. Faint, fleeting secret of a maiden hidden in the heart of a female-type enemy. Strange. All right, well, that's why we got return crystals. Cool. So that worked. So, hi! What's up? Ah, that's... Kind of the secret. Thanks, Kishinami dear. I know this request was totally unreasonable, but Teach knew you could do it. 
take this as a token of my gratitude. It's a special item that was being secretly kept in the staff room. Tiger style hobby goods. Now at last, I can get back to the school building where everyone is waiting. This will be my last try. This also brings an end to the Tiger quest. Thank you very much for all the help up until this point. Kiss you, Nami, sweetie. See you later. I'll be waiting for you in our afternoon class. Miss Fujimura rushes off with a big smile on her face. Knowing Taiga, she'll make a real dynamic escape. I'll believe in her success as I go and take care of my own business. Yeah. Fujimura Taiga died on the way back to her home planet. Rest in peace. Let's go check out what these hobby goods are. What 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 sort of hobby goods could we get? That's just a porn magazine back there. Why is that behind? Okay, whatever. Sure, I'm guessing that says husband and wife. There's a freaking tissue box. Oh my god. Calm yourself. Anyways, apparently there are three optional bosses fought on the the uh in floor 20. Huh. They're fought in the order of west, east, and north. Huh. Maybe we should go check that out. Well, first things first. Let's pop a save here. Right? We'll save again here just because we're gonna we're holding off on not using that stuff. Um Let's, if we can get that, then that means next time we can do the endings, right? So let's go take a look. Let's go down. Can we go right down to floor 20? We can't. That's fine. We'll go here. And let's see here. I didn't see optional bosses, but maybe now that we've done the Taiga quest, they're going to be there. And it says that it gives us powerful things, which we can use for uh, on the next New Game Plus run. Which we will be doing. Because, of course... All right, so we need to go, so specifically it says, we go west, east, and then north. So if we look at this map, west, I gotta battle you again. Okay, I'll just do this quickly here. Stun against break, we'll use this, we'll do stun against break, and then that should just, we should just win there. Okay, because we should beat you. Okay, oh, I could have even just attacked you and not worried about the next stun. Okay. It's a little annoying, but... Should be fine to start the battle with slightly less stuff. Okay, so is it like down here in this little area that looked very clearly, obviously, a thing? No? Okay. This is west, right? Hold up. What are we doing? How do we do these bonus battles? Okay. Sakura, Labyrinth, level 20, uh, floor 20. That's not giving me what I need. Um... Yeah, let's just go, f let's just go Fate Extra... CCC walkthrough. Is there one? Okay, walkthrough guide. Servant guide. That's not what I want. I want to see. Perfect guide. That's a real book. This doesn't tell me where to find these. Defeat the three optional bosses. Fate extra CCC. Optional bosses? Where are these? Okay. Okay, there's special things to be done. I beat the boss monster in the leveling dungeon. Okay. You should be able to challenge them in your first playthrough. Do I need to do something special? From what I need to do, you need to complete... Oh, you need to complete the Servant SG first. Oh. Interesting. Okay. Well, then we can't do that. Huh. I guess we'll come back after for that, because we don't want to do that just yet, because we want to instead, you know, be beat the game on normal first, and then... Okay, so I guess what we'll be doing is... Let's return to the previous floor. Is there a save point here? 
There seems to not be, but there's one on the previous floor. Okay, let's go out there, let's save. And the next time we'll go, we'll beat that. We'll do the boss. We'll do it. We'll do the we'll do our yeah, we'll get the normal ending. We'll get the SG. We'll beat the secret boss. We'll then go and yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh return to the previous floor. I see, I see. Because I feel like the ending is going to take a bit of time. So sounds good. Alright, guys. We will see you next time for probably the end of Tamamo's story here. I'm gonna pop, I'm just gonna keep popping safety saves, even if there's a ton of them. It's a little annoying, but we gotta do it. We'll see you next time for the normal end, and then possibly also the other end. I have no idea how long the endings are, but we'll see. We'll see you then, guys, for that. Ciao. Yo. Yeah.